Hey, what's up? I'm Felice Lose, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to use the iRig Stream Solo for content creation. If you're looking for an easy way to elevate your content with high quality audio, then you're in the right place. This little device is really simple to use and can help take your content creation game up a notch. So stay tuned and I'll show you how it works. So here's the iRig Stream Solo. It connects to your social platforms like TikTok, Instagram, Twitter, and more, allowing you to capture high quality audio content with ease. It's really easy to use and it's perfect for content creators, musicians, and singers who wanna produce professional sounding audio. On a lot of platforms, especially TikTok, where organic and not overly produced content tends to perform better, you can find a balance between looking like you're not trying too hard and still standing out from the crowd. This is achieved by making sure your audio content sounds top notch. A lot of times you'll see a singer performing on a video and the video might be less than cinematic, but the audio sounds great. That's where an interface like this iRig Stream Solo comes in. And even vice versa, if you're filming content with a professional camera, the audio still matters, and this is a great tool to help you capture better sound. Now let's talk about what makes this little piece of hardware so great. The iRig Stream Solo is super easy to use, and you don't need special skills to get started. It has two RCA inputs, a headphone out with integrated mic input, one built-in TRRS cable that connects directly to your device, which runs audio into social media platforms through your phone, and another eighth inch mono output to send audio signal to another device, and it's clearly labeled through on the iRig. Plus, you can set your stream level independent of your headphone monitoring level, which is really helpful. It's battery powered, which is great for producing content on the go. The loopback feature, is a great way to monitor audio from live social audio apps like Twitter Spaces, while also monitoring your own voice or any other audio you are broadcasting through the iRig without experiencing any lag or delay. Because the iRig Stream Solo has RCA inputs as the main source, you can connect to pretty much any device like a mixer, audio interface, or your computer sound card. However, the downside is I think the RCA inputs might throw off a content creator who mainly creates video or social audio with a microphone. But I'm here to show you why it's so great that we have RCA inputs on this device. These RCA inputs allow you to connect a stereo line level source. That's just a fancy way of saying we can connect the source like an audio interface or a mixer to this iRig. What really makes this a powerful feature is that you can connect a high quality microphone like this condenser microphone to your audio interface, then mix your audio on your digital audio workstation known as a DAW like Pro Tools, Logic, or Ableton and produce a really high quality production before bringing it into social media platforms through this iRig Stream Solo. Okay, so let me break this down a little more so you can create social audio content that will make your friends jealous. The setup I'm about to go over is really best for a singer or even a content creator whose voice will be mixed with music tracks. So the signal flow will go a little something like this. First, you would talk or sing into the microphone that is connected to your audio interface. For example, I'm using this Avid Mbox Studio interface, which has built-in microphone preamps to connect a condenser mic like that blue mouse you just saw. Then your signal would be directed into your DAW where you can mix your voice with any music tracks or instruments, whether they're being played live or they are pre-recorded. In this step, you can add compression, EQ, reverb, or any other processing to really make your audio shine. After this, you would route your audio back out of your DAW through the same audio interface connected to your computer through its RCA outputs into your RCA inputs on the iRig Stream Solo. And voila! you have now achieved a professional broadcast quality mix of live and pre-recorded sources. You can use this setup when you're live streaming on social audio platforms like Twitter Spaces or video live streaming platforms like TikTok Live or Instagram Live. Or you could even use this setup if you're creating regular posted content like TikTok videos and Instagram reels where you're filming the videos directly in the app and need to process your audio prior to the app. 
This achieves that unproduced feel of the visual that we talked about earlier while making it stand out with high quality sound. Well, that's it. You now know some ways you may not have considered using the iRig Stream Solo to create content that will really pop with high-end audio production. So go ahead, get creative, and start producing social audio content like never before with the help of this powerful workflow. And if you want to go deeper into how to produce social audio content, my Audio Files Toolkit is a great resource with step-by-step -step tutorials, gear recommendations, and special discounts. You can get it at the link in the description of this video. Thanks for watching, and if you have any questions about the iRig Stream Solo or how to use this production workflow, please leave them in the comments below. And also drop some links of the content you're producing because I want to see it.